What's up ladies and all gentlemen, my name is Destroyer and welcome to the demo for Espresso Tycoon. Oh yes, I do love my coffee. I are out. Uh, this is obviously the demo. The full game does release on the 7th of June, I do believe, 2023. But uh, fun fact, I have already uh, played this and actually recorded uh, this this gameplay. But uh, unfortunately, when I went to play it back, it, uh, it was corrupted. So, or corrupt. So I thought, well, you know what, that sucks, but I'll give it another go. So take two. Let's see campaign and have a little geese here. That's why it says mission complete, because I've already played it. But uh, uh, you've won a contest titled by I've Had Enough of Corporate Work, which I thought was quite a funny name for a contest. Um, and the grand prize is an opportunity to intern at cafes all around the globe. Your journey begins in Cape Town, South Africa, where you'll get to learn the ins and outs of running a small coffee truck or gaining valuable business skills. So obviously sell five coffees. And uh, in the full game, I think there's 10 destinations you can go to. But uh, some of them here are New York, Sao Paulo, good old Perry, Siberia, London, Mexico City, good old Australia in Sydney, but Sydney sucks, Los Angeles, Tokyo, and I think that is it. Back to Cape Town. So anyway, let's start this mission. Good old uh, cutscenes. I will let it play out. Fantastic. You be the winner of the contest. Nice to meet you. My name is Kim, and I'm here to help guide you during your coffee journey. We're going to travel around the world together, starting here in a beautiful park in Cape Town. Do you see this humble coffee truck over there? Let's start with creating a brand for it. I do, I do see it. Thanks, Kim. Uh, so, basically, I know what I'm doing, but uh, I might pretend that I don't. For realism, you know, dramatic effect. Coffee beans. Uh, let's name this place... Destroy Her. Font. Yeah, it's not too bad. I don't think it really matters, but uh, I like that. That typewriter look. Uh, red's my favorite color. Alright, all done. Wow, what a brand. I bet your place will attract customers like bees to honey, or like pigeons to coffee? Wait, what's going on? You what, mate? Oh yeah, the coffee's drinking- the coffee. The pigeon's drinking the coffee and then it starts to moonwalk. There it goes, it's going off its tits, look at that. I've seen many weird things in my career, but a caffeinated pigeon is definitely something new. In any case, let's learn how to navigate the scene. By the way, if you ever need help with any task, just click the show me how button for more detailed instructions. You know what? Caffeinated pigeon's actually a good name for a cafe. <laughs> right, so it's how we move. Like that. Done. Pretty easy, right? But that's not all. In our world, you can fly around freely like a pigeon. Or you can switch from strategic to pigeon or cinematic camera mode to see the world from different angles. Try it now. Yep. From memory, that's tab. Now that you know how to move the camera, let's get to work. First, we need to buy some chairs and tables so people can sit down and relax. We should also consider adding some additional lighting, just in case someone is sipping on a coffee all evening long. Okay. Well, how long am I? 24 hours? What's going on? Anyway, we'll buy some chairs and tables. I'll buy the same stuff that I did in the video that... Oops. That was corrupted, so I'll just use these chairs. Put that about there. And there. There we go. So we go to tables. I think I chose this one. There we go. They've got to buy two tables, which I find is a little weird because you only have to buy two chairs, but you'd think you would have to buy four. There we go. And have one lamp. I chose this little thing. Yay! The park is looking empty. I mean, cozy. You're almost ready to start earning money, but we still need to create a menu for customers to order from. Okay. So we open up the menu. Okay, so we've got espresso. Add it, an Americano. 
such a diverse menu. Anyway, to help you out, I've already hired a barista and stocked up on basic supplies that you'll need to start serving coffee. You're all set to go. Now, it's time to see how your first customer buys a coffee. Probably with money. I'm guessing. I love it how there's like dogs and cats running around. I mean, no one walks a cat like that. If that's your cat lady, I mean, come on. What are you doing? Congratulations on your first sale. While you might not be rich just yet, with a few more million sales, you'll be well on your way. Let's take a closer look at that customer now. With a few more million sales? Uh, one thing I didn't really, or don't really like about this demo or the game, um, is the fact you don't actually make the coffee, it's done automatically. And I find that a little disappointing because I would like to actually make the coffees myself, but whatever. Right, so click any cus customer, so we'll click on this dude, or chick, I don't know what it was. Uh, casual, taking it easy, one day at a time, and putting off responsibilities until they absolutely have to be done. Bean talk and Beanstagram are their periscope for life. Meet Johnny Doe, a casual. It's good to know your Johnny customers. Doe. Fortunately, equipped with an amazing mind reading device, you can see what your customers really think about their experience. Each review affects your rating points, so pay attention. Can you see his review of your coffee price? I can. The price of Americano is very affordable. Okay, close that. When you see your customers are happy about the affordable price of coffee, you may consider increasing it a bit to earn more money. Let's try that now. Okay. Right, so we have to raise the price of the espresso. Let's put... Let's make it 294. Yeah. Yep. As you can see, analyzing reviews from your customers can give you valuable insights into how to grow your business. But don't forget about the other customers. Click on the highlighted one. Will do. Hello, highlighted customer. Okay, hipster. Always on the hunt for the next... Artist anal. I'm only joking. <laughs> Organic, humor-free, weird, everything, cruelty-free, fair trade, ethically sourced, and local coffee. This is Marco Polo, a hipster. Cool name, As bro. See, Marco Polo. Go, but you don't have any takeaway cups. No, I do not. I wanted to order a coffee to go, but they have no takeaway cups. That's what she said. Literally. It's a good opportunity to learn how to order supplies. Let's make your customer happy and order some takeaway cups for him. All right, let's do it. So up to supplies, disposables, simple cups, order. Two hundred and seventy-one bucks. Just wait a bit. In the twenty-first century, drones can deliver your order. In our world, people are okay. Keep forgetting that I can move with the keys. It's a normal part of our mundane life. Okay, collect that. Hey, guess what, buddy? I just got a bunch of disposable cups in. Check them out. Check them out. <laughs> uh, there's another cat. Could you walk any slower, bro? There we go. That's the way. Walk You're in front of people. Very fast. You've analyzed customer reviews and taken action to improve your profits and customer experience. That's how you build a successful business. There's one more customer waiting. Let's take care of her too. Why did you order it when it's not your favorite coffee, dude? All right. Student, pulling all-nighters like it's their part-time job, surviving on ramen and caffeine, and trying to find the meaning of life in between lectures. Meet Dana Very Mulder, stereotypical here. It looks like she really likes Dana Mulder. I'm not surprised at all. Look at the way she's You've sitting. Jeez. Three different social groups. Very lady-like. Missions, you'll meet even more. Remember, each social group has different expectations. Mm-hmm. So she likes the style of this place. That's nice. You're actually in the park itself, love. So. If you zoom in on the place where the student was sitting, you'll notice that she left some rubbish behind. This happens sometimes. Some customers can be a bit messy. Let's clean it up so the next customer won't complain. Why do I have to do that? I don't work for the council or anything. I'm, I've got my own coffee truck. I'm not part of the cleanup crew. Anyway. <laughs> What's with the skull and crossbones? That can't be that dangerous. Better. Just a heads up, sometimes you might need to focus on a task, but there's a lot going on around you. 
In these situations, you can always pause the game and take your time. Try pausing and resuming now. Pretty useful, right? With the game paused, you can do your job without rushing. On the other hand, when you're waiting for something and don't have much to do, hey, speed lady. up the game. You can always go back to standard speed later. Try them both now. Hey. Now you know how to manipulate time. Look at her face, though. Almost ready to go, but remember, some customers come with their pets. It would be nice to offer some water for them to drink while their owners enjoy a cup of coffee. Let's make that happen now. What's with the face, Kim? All right, uh, I'm gonna zoom out again. It's kind of opposite too. It's weird. It's always, it's, it's almost like the controls are inverted. But anyway, we've got to buy some dog bowls. I think they're under special. Yep. Uh, red's my favorite color, so I'm just gonna grab two red ones. Uh, so many happy dog tails. My boss, Mister I Hate Him, tells me I'm needed elsewhere now. I'm confident that you'll be able to complete this mission on your own. Check out the mission window to see your goals in progress. We'll see each other again soon. I promise. One Mr. I time, hate him. Check hmm. if you still have coffee beans. That's funny. That's what I call my boss. Not really. My boss is actually pretty cool. Right, so we need to get... Okay, we've got to sell five coffees. I know that. Supplies. Okay, we need to... No. I forgot what I had to do. Oh, there you go. <laughs> it's right there. Uh, instant delivery, 254 bucks. You can see the expense is real. Let's get four units. You can probably afford that. Okay, zoom out a bit. Okay. Negative, negative. Negative Nancy over here. Right. Because I think that's technically the end of the mission. Like, you know, where it walks you through it. I just have to sell five coffees. Hello. The price of Americano is a bit high, but I decided to give it a try anyway. See, this is where I wish, like, you could actually make the coffee from scratch. That'd be kind of cool. $8.59? Hang on a minute. Americano should be two eighty six. Why is it so expensive? You can prepare 47 cups of this coffee. 56 cups. Huh. Anyway. Anyone else want a coffee? It's not high, alright? It's $2.86. Why are they paying $8.59? That's one thing I don't really understand. But you can look around here and I think... There was a crate, yeah, this chest here, and you get some money. Look at that, a thousand bucks just sitting there. Now, what I might quickly do is, um, zoom in. Not that much, maybe about there. And grab a couple of chairs for this table, because it looks kind of odd. Because I'm pretty sure we can afford it now. Try and get them as close. Okay, well, there you go. <laughs> There's the five coffees sold. Now, well done, you've taken a small step as a businessman, but a giant leap as an intern. You'll destroy a coffee truck in Cape Town. It's a place where people feel relaxed, sip on delicious coffee, and have fun with their furry friends. As a reward for your hard work, we're excited to unlock another feature for you, Coffee Editor. Uh, you'll find it in the menu on the bottom left. Get creative and come up with unique coffee recipes because a challenging campaign is coming in the full version. And to top it off, we've deposited two grand into your bank account so you can just, uh, decorate the park however you like. See you soon. All right, there you go. Yep. They got sandbox and all that, obviously, when the full game does released. Released? When the full game does release. Yeah, okay, new items, blah, 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 coffee editor. And you do get a launch discount if you buy it, whatever. Uh, but let me know in the comments if you're interested in seeing a full playthrough of this. Um, no. Okay, R to rotate. Right there. There we go. Cool. Right, coffee editor. Where was that again? Yeah. Right. So we get to pick our mug. Meow. Meow. Uh, it's like a nice traditional sort of cafe sort of, you know, cut size of cup, coffee cup. I'm going to name this one Bob. All right. In Bob, we'll have espresso. Cold milk. 
Wait, I can't add that because they're red, so... Warm milk and steamed milk with some hot water. I really don't know because we don't have these other supplies, hence why they're in red, I think. Okay. Next step. Save that. All right. Let's add that to the menu. And let's make Bob four bucks. Or as close as we can get to four bucks. There we go. Let's see if any NPCs will buy a Bob. Hey, mate, you want a Bob? No reviews. Uh, this menu doesn't offer any coffee I would order. Really? Actually, let, let me know in the comments. Like, I've heard of Americano, but what exactly is Americano? What makes it Americano? Like, I suppose I could... Have a look. Hot water and espresso. Is that all Americano is? Okay. Are you sure you wouldn't lose it? Uh, yeah. I didn't make any changes. I just wanted to look at what the recipe was. So, I guess Americano is basically like instant coffee. This menu doesn't offer any coffee. Okay. Come on. Someone try a bob. You, lady. What do you reckon? Wow. Okay. okay. That's why they're just walking past, because they have no interest in what I'm offering. And I thought this was a little weird. Look at this. Flamingos just in the park. Wow, look at that sandcastle, though. That's cool. A nice fountain. Statue. Number two flamingos with... Oh, it's a duck. I thought that was a crab. Alright, so no one really seems to uh, want to buy any more... Co oh, here we go. Bob, it's not my favourite coffee. The price of Bob is very affordable. Eventually I decided to order Bob, although it's not my favourite. Hey, punk lady. Hipster. Come buy a coffee. Yep. Sit down and enjoy that Bob. Go on. Actually, you know what? I'm going to grab another lamp. Why not? I know you can change the color of it, but who cares? Just a demo. There we go. Ooh, achievement unlocked. 25 style points. Nice. Okay, this dude's going to buy a bob. You look like a hipster. Are you a hipster? Oh, I can't click on him because of... There we go. Yeah, you are. Nice hair, bro. Chandler Harris, 18 years old. Very affordable bob. Wait a minute. Why is... I don't get that. The Bob's like three bucks, yeah? Or say four dollars. But he just spent fifteen dollars something on that Bob. What about you? How much are you gonna pay? I love that this place is pet friendly, yep. Wait, what's the money pop up in a sec? Three dollars and ninety seven cents. Okay, we've got the fifteen what? That doesn't make any sense. Oh this dude was waiting, but he's not interested now. He's walking. He doesn't doesn't offer any coffee he likes. Well, screw you. Dog, have a drink. Actually, can we put water in that? I don't even know. I'll just walk over to the fountain and uh, <laughs> fill it up. Okay. So I guess the idea of this is obviously, you know, you upgrade from a coffee truck to like a actual, you know, brick and mortar cafe. Oh, cat. Does the cat want a coffee? I can't click on the cat. You love it how it's pet friendly. Well then why don't, why don't you grab an espresso or Americano, huh? Hey lady. Shirley Cooper. Casual. Haha, <laughs> I bet she is. What about your friend here? You casual too? No, you're a student. Oh, Dana Mulder. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're the litterer. Had to pick up your rubbish before. But yeah, so obviously th this mission is actually finished. Because um, I think that is actually it. For the demo, I mean, you can continue on and just make some money, I guess. And I'm not sure, like, if I decide to play the full game when it does release. Um, I wonder if this carries over or if I have to start from the start again. Okay, is that your dog? Hey. Janet Hill. How do I know your name? Just I click on you? That's really odd. Doggy. Can I pet the doggy? They just barked at me and I clicked on him. Dog fight. <laughs> Yeah, but yeah, there we go. I mean, just really, it's just rinse and repeat now. 
Okay, Bob's... They always say the same thing. It's very affordable, even though it's not. Nearly 16 bucks for a coffee. Um, yeah, but they love it how it's pet friendly, which is kind of cool. But uh, what I might do is actually leave the demo there. Let me know in the comments, guys, if you want to see a full playthrough of this. After it is released on the 7th of June, 2023. Let me know if you played this. Let me know your thoughts on the game. Do you like it? Uh, do you agree with me where I think... Like, I'd rather make the actual coffee, you know, with the machine and actually do things. And, you know, even if it's just a basic point and click mechanic... I think I'd rather do that, but, uh, but yeah, like I said, let me know if you'd like to see a full play through, play through of this when it does finally re finally release. But, uh, but yeah, if you did enjoy this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel for more content, make sure to hit that notification bell so you're notified of every single upload, and I'll catch you in the next video. Adios.